You know what I think about that? Fucking rebel. <laughs> that fog rainbow? That's definitely a rainbow in the fog, right? I did not see that with the naked eye. I was originally just gonna say good morning. Welcome to a foggy area. Welcome to a foggy morning. Uh, but that, that's pretty freaking cool. So welcome to a foggy morning. Double rainbow all the way. <laughs> you want to go to the end of it over there and see there's a pot of gold starting. That's cool. All right. Welcome to another video back in Pennsylvania. And this is my, yeah, my first run since being back. And it's been a long time since I've been on the trails in my sandals. And that's what we're doing today. I have a trail run coming up in about two weeks three weeks maybe and I'm doing it in the sandals so let's get out here let's hit some trails and enjoy the sounds of nature and fog rainbows that's super awesome so it is pretty obvious that I'm the first ones out here today because I am clearing a trail in all the spider webs. Whew. Look, there's a buck. Hey, you. What's up? He doesn't know I see him. You're a big dude, sort of. Okay. Well, hey, I'm gonna keep going for my run, okay? You just chill. Bye. What the heck is this about? Is it closed because of the tree? Or closed because there's a mansion at the bottom of the hill? I'm gonna guess the down trees. What the heck, where am I supposed to go? Back? I guess, but it's been here for a while. I feel it's only I've not been here. All right. Well, I guess guess what I'm. Well, guess what I'm doing. I want to trespass. It doesn't say no trespassing. It says trail closed, which is a different thing. All right. Let's step over here Ugh, into the poison ivy. Weed. All right. Now join me on this trekking adventure up and over fallen trees. Oh, they're chopping stuff down. Oh yeah, look at this. They did this on purpose. All these are cut down on purpose. Yeah. I mean, this is a difficult trail. And if you look, it's a steep downgrade. A lot of water runoff that runs through this. I can see like people getting hurt on mountain bikes. I've never crashed here. I might, I know people wipe out at the bottom of the hill because it takes a hard left. But yeah, these are purposely cut down. Messed up. Purpose. Man, they are making it so no one wants to come down here. Oop. Screw y'all. And there is the mansion. You see it? We'll get another shot of it. Yeah, man. They really did it. Look. They want to make it so these people don't have people running in their backyard. That's what it is. I wonder who bought it. They sold this place. Whoa. Whoa. Probably before COVID started. I wonder who it is. I wonder some rich person. 
There's a little smith. Somebody bought this place. It's gorgeous, but not maintained. But you can see now they're working on it. Screwing up my pace, trees. They blocked off the other end. Of course. But there's the house. Check that out. That is a gorgeous, gorgeous property. They sold for a few million. Empty though. Nothing in it. I'm not gonna walk up there, but you can see through the big windows. There's no furniture. And you can see how much has not been maintained. That pool probably needs to be redone entirely. Alright. Alright, let's get through this. Alright though. I'm gonna get through the rest of this. There's a few more trees to climb over, and I will see you all on the other side. Alright. Alright, I just got to the, the end of that. And now it says no trespassing. It did not say that anywhere else along the trail. So, but I don't know if that's like, I mean, I guess it's legit, but the county or township probably put that up. So, you know what I think about that? Fucking rebel. <laughs> that's horrible, man. I get the trail. Nah. All right, back to running. Now out here, next to the water, just soaking in that zen. But that trail, that trail's been, it's been there for since the beginning of time. And there's really only one or two explanations for that. Is it one, is that that down part is pretty dangerous. If you're on a horse or a mountain bike, yeah, I can see that being a problem. But people have been doing it. I've been doing that on a mountain bike forever, decades. The second reason is that someone rich, influential, bought that property and they didn't want people riding in the back, so they're closing it down, which is what I'm going with. I mean, I guess if I'm Warren Buffett, I don't want people walking in my backyard either, but that's not the backyard. I just had to take a moment to enjoy this. A little walk in the water. My mountain bike hasn't seen the light of day since before my daughter was born. So probably not good. She turned five soon or five years. <laughs> Done the run. And now to do one of my favorite things about this trail. If you didn't see it in the opening, a well. There's not many of these old fashioned wells left. I mean, we had them growing up on some family farms. So you actually have to pump it to get any water out of it. So that means 
I can't really hold you and do it. Oh, but that's it. Almost four miles exactly. I stopped it at 3.98 just to bother some people because I know that will bother some people. I think it's funny. Sorry. Hope you enjoyed it. Plenty more sandals runs, trail runs coming up in the future. I need to get back out here and keep at it. And uh, get off the road. I'm tired of the road. I really am. Uh, this is... This is where I belong. But alright. That's it. I'm not taking you back to the family this time. Get back and do the kids thing. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button if you haven't already. Subscribe. And I'll see you all on all the future videos. And never quit. Whew.